Hi guys, long time no see. Um, I just started, cut open the box, started to do a box opening, and um, because my Wi-Fi was on on one of my, my phones, and I forgot to turn the flash on, someone called and cut off the, f so I shut everything else off so I can't interrupt this video. All I did was get one sock off the baby, and that was it. So... Let's get into this box opening. I just got this baby nest. It is, um, I picked, chose gray with white crowns. And we can go boy or girl. And it cinches and ties with a big bow on the bottom here. It comes with a little blanket that you can have it on the minky side or the gray. It also comes with this really soft on one side. And it's like a waterproof um, pad. So if you had a real baby in there. So I'm just going to move those because I just want to use. And it took me a minute. I'm still kind of shaping it. Um, but I got it on eBay from wholesalers. And it was only $16.99 and free shipping. And also... Sorry, here's like squealing like... Um, brakes of a truck. I wonder if that was a delivery truck. Um, of course, eBay has tax now, but still. It, and you unzip it in the bottom and slip the mattress in, which is pretty nice foam. And I said that'd be great for unboxings and changing babies, things like that. So, this is a very special box. It has been here tomorrow, will be two weeks. Been having a lot going on, so I could not. Um, Get to these babies, and these are very special babies, and there's two in this box. So, without further ado, because I've been waiting and anticipating. Oh my goodness, this baby's heavy. <laughs> okay, let me see. Look at this baby. <laughs> so, it is dressed as a girl. Look at this sweet little sweater. And there's two in this box. This box is very heavy. So as soon as I show you, all I got off was the sock, and then it cut out the video. As soon as I show you the feet, or the leg, y'all gonna know who this baby is. So let's look at the other little, this is a sweet little sweater outfit. Knitted. There's other little toes. I found this artist on eBay. She also makes um, alternative babies. But I was searching for this sculpt and I bid in one and then she had another one and we'll get into that story. So I ended up getting them both. But you can see these chubby little legs. Oh my goodness. And I looked at other people's boxings and I was thinking, oh, to go over the width of that leg, going to need a big, like, three months or so. And actually, it's smaller than you think. Um, so I seen on other people's videos, it was newborn. And Target just had a big sale on a bunch of clothes. And then it was, um, besides the sale price, they had, like, a Target offer. You click the offer and it applies to your checkout. Another 10% off. So I just got clothes for... I was thinking these babies and mind. Oh my goodness. So this is a double box opening and I have another two. So I had four babies arrive all on like a day apart. Oh my goodness, look at that hand. Okay, is there like a onesie? There's like a little shirt underneath see a little little black speck I don't know what that is look at the wrinkles full limbs oh my goodness look at the details and you can tell by the flesh colors it looks like the colors of the insides of my hands you know what I mean like you're blushing and everything Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. 
So I don't know if I'm going to be able to, oh, yeah, the sun buttons. Take it off over the head. Because I'm trying to take it down to the diaper. So these are both special babies. So there's a little headband. And I opened the box upside down to protect addresses. And when I did, there was this in between the flaps, a passy. So if I didn't open it upside down, it could have like, it was in between the flaps, I wouldn't have found it. So she has like this little side snap, but I'm thinking this baby's going to be a boy. Even though it was dressed and sold as a girl. Are you ready? Y'all probably know who this is. I will show you the COA in a moment after we size five diaper to go over this head. Okay, let's scooch the body down. And, oh my, okay. So that's what happens. I was like worried because it was in the diaper. You'll see like little oils. That's from like the jellies inside the diaper. Little red dot right there. Oh my goodness. So the hair is actually like a, kind of like a reddish brown, like a blonde. Like a blondish. Look at the amazing painted hair. So if you don't know who this is, let me see if I can turn this way. <clears throat> the angle of this camera is just not doing it. Let me see. It tells you. Oh my goodness. Looking at boxes I'm unboxing here. Come on, baby. This is the head is so heavy. Oh my goodness. I'm going to have to take some weight out. This is the Nino Sculpt, which this baby has achondroplasia, which is a form of dwarfism. And I wanted this sculpt when it came out. Yeah, look. The head is like, okay, I'm going to pick up the head. Ready? <laughs> the head is very, very heavy. Look at those lashes. Oh my goodness. Very long. Rooted lashes. There's like little... See where it looks like? Almost like oil marks. But what it is, is it's a... Uh, look at the little button nose and the wrinkles. Oh my goodness. A couple of those lashes I'm about to trim. Very long. There's a little dot here. I don't know. But look at the little wrinkles in the chin. The details in the ears. But you see where it looks like wet? And you're like, oh my goodness, is that? I'll have to just take a damp cloth over. What is this? The oils in the diaper. And I shouldn't have had her in. Um, the jelly oils in a cloth diaper can uh, like affect with the vinyl. Oh my goodness. And you can see that she is, there's a couple little blue dots here too. That must have been her undercoating. She is the Nino by Vincenzia Care, Trueborn 2020. So she is actually a Chenza. She is the Nino and Trueborns.com sold it. Uh, but the artist sculptor, or not the artist, sorry, the sculptor is, I can never get, I just call her Chenza, by Vincenzia Care True Limited Edition, and, and then there's facts about achondroplasia dwarfism is the most common form of dwarfism. The main characteristics are larger heads, flat nasal bridge, frontal bossing, shorter bowed legs, average size torso characteristics caused by a mutation of, and it says the gene, um, occurs in uh, every 15,000 to 1 in 40,000 births. There are over 200 different types of dwarfism in ancient times. People with achondroplasia were considered gods throughout all different cultures, including but not 
limited to Egyptian, Norse, and Hinduism. So there is different. It looks like this one. This is the prototype one that was painted and sculpted. But um, has the reddish brown hair. I just, oh my goodness. I was like, yes. The lips look redder in the photos. And I was worried about that. And they look that redder on cam. But excuse the marker. I was <laughs> with Jake. And he got some on me. Um, but they're really not. Uh, I'm trying to see something. Here, what do you do with your posse? What do you do with your posse? But I think she is adorable. I'm going to have to take some weighting out of her head, though. But she is... Oh, my goodness. So, on to... Yeah, I have, like, six babies here waiting to get a box. So, it's like... Oh... We gotta unbox your sister. She's in the same box waiting. Okay, so I'm gonna move this baby over for a moment. Oh, and here is the second baby. Yes, it's a double box opening. So she has little socks on her hands. And she's wearing this little teddy bear sleeper. So it's going to be easy to... She doesn't have a one zero diaper on, so it's going to be easy to... So I won that one and, by bidding. And then this one was, you know, buy it now or best, or, you know, best offer. And she's like, well, I see you're, you know, into that one. And I was like, yep. Okay, I don't... What is that? See, like, there's a brown... And there's like a little liquid here. I don't know if it was. <laughs> but look at the feet. Oh my goodness. And like I said, she makes alternatives. I don't know what that is. You see that? Right there and there. But I'm sure it'll wash off. But look at the chunky thighs. And this one has a lot of modeling. I mean. This one is a very special baby, and you will see in a moment. Let's look at, and this one is full limbs as well. I forgot the other one is full limbs. And she does make alternative babies. I see she has an ethnic baby right now. There is her other hand. She looks kind of red on camera, but she's not. See, like, how red my hands look on camera? My fingertips are not red like that in person. So. I was like, oh my goodness, she's got both of them. And I was interested in this one as well. I know someone, um, Dolls Happy 2 channel, her and her mom. She just got this baby made as a custom. And I was like, oh my goodness. Because her son, oh, I can't release it yet, but. Da, da, da. Look at those blue eyes. Oh my goodness. Does your passy fit you? Oh no, it's the opposite. It's rejecting it. <laughs> oh my goodness. I love her painted hair, she is the patient sculpt, which is a Down Syndrome baby. So I got two special needs babies. So, um, like I was saying, Dolls Happy 2, when Paradise Galleries came out with the Noah Down Syndrome doll, she got that one, but she wanted this sculpt done, and she had an artist do it, and... Um, I was seeing hers, and I was like, oh, I'd like one, and then this artist, when I was searching for Nino, she had this one, too, and she's like, well, I'll ship them together, and we made it, you know, I put in a best offer, and she accepted, and we combined the shipping and everything, and shipped them both, we had to see if they both would fit in the box, and they did, so, 
And it's a heavy box between these two. But she's very well weighted. Oh my goodness, say hello. So she, so we have, um, let me see, let's dress her quickly. So I'm, tr I've been trying to think of unique names because, you know, one has Down syndrome, one has dwarfism, and I'm thinking, so these are two special needs babies. So I was trying to think, but the boy, um, the, uh, Dwarfism baby, I want as a boy. This one I'm, I'm gonna keep as a girl. But um, the achondroplasia, Nino, I want as a boy. And I keep, I kept coming back to Chandler. I don't know why, but I don't know if it's gonna. Hunter and Chandler, but it kept coming back to Chandler, and I'm like. I just wanted something unique. So if you guys can give me some name suggestions. Um, I already have a Paisley. So I thought like this being the patients, you know, like Paisley would be a pretty name for a Down syndrome baby. But I was like, I already have a Paisley in my nursery. Okay, I'm going to try and sit these two. You can see how big Nino is compared to her. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Okay, I know my camera's the opposite way. Let me see, I'm gonna take the camera out to track. Ooh. Okay, floppy, lay your head back. Oh, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna take it off the tripod here. Okay, now it's still in sideways version. No matter which way I go, they're sideways. Okay, how is it not? Let me turn the camera, it's not turning. Okay, this is strange. Every time I turn the camera, they're turning sideways no matter which way I turn the phone. That is strange. Alright, so we're going to have to lay them down then. Oh, there goes Nina. Oh yeah, Nina. Oh my goodness. Once they Nino and my mom, my kids call her Nina. Why is it sideways? That's strange. Okay, this is not... This phone did not... When I picked it up, it's just like stuck in this one mode. No matter which way I turn it. You can see the little feets. Oh my goodness. Look at these two. She's staring off like, ah! She has very bright eyes. I don't know if I'm going to add lashes to her. I can't even get it to go straight at all. Oh, my goodness. So, let me know what you guys think of these two. And with that said, like, comment, subscribe, and as usual, stay blessed, stay beautiful, and happy hauling.